What a great win for us in terms of, of where we are, where we wanted to, you know, kind of compare apples to apples and see, you know, how we could compare against uh, a good FCS program. And, you know, that's a, that's a great program that won their conference last year, picked to win it this year. Um, you know, they have, uh, they have some good players, and they were known for being very physical. And I was, I was very pleased with the fact that I thought we played a physical brand of football that, that, uh, that could be the mark of what we are and who we are. So very proud of these guys. My, you know, Owen, great job over 100 yards rushing. You know, Bill uh, Murray, if there's somebody that's better that's in, you know, FCS, even FBS football as a nose tackler, I don't know where they are. Um, he ended up playing over three different centers tonight and was wreaking all kind of havoc and just uh, very proud to be be a part of this and watch these guys flourish and and just watch our team bounce back from a you know tough F FBS loss and just know that you know we're allowed to get better and uh, we got better tonight. Questions? Coach, you mentioned it was a tough game against Virginia. Do you think you guys came into this game with a little bit of a chip on your shoulder and that contributed to your offensive kind of just absolute explosion at the beginning? Well, not as much as a chip on our shoulder because of what happened in Virginia. Um, we got to take care of ourselves and improve the way we uh, you know, where we played and our efficiency, how we ran the ball, and it was it was good to see that there was a level of high contact. F football is a physical game. That team was known for, and their, their bread and butter is known for running the ball, and we were able to, at some points, you know, create TFLs, third and long situations, uh, sacks, and we were able ourselves to run the ball, and that's 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 the most positive thing we got out of it was. You get better from the second game to this game. Now the goal is to get better from this game to the next and not just rest on our laurels. We still got a lot of work to do, a lot of, lot of plays still out there on the field. But again, tonight was a, was, was a good, tough, physical win for this program against a good football team. You touched on this in your opening comment. Did, how much of this game did you see sort of as a measuring stick, not only as a apples to apples, as you said, but as a team that beat William and Mary pretty handily? Well, this is a new team. Our, our, our identity is new, and on all the things, you know, what happened last year happened last year. We all saw the tape, but our our our, our mindset, our resolve is 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 be as physical as we need to be, create turnovers, and we did that again tonight. Um, you know, run the ball against them uh, because they were they're a tough physical team, and we were able to do that and uh, be able to play a lot of players. That was the other goal too. So, um, again, it was good to see that you know. The team and these two gentlemen right here are uh, very much a part of who we are, what we want to be, and, and and moving forward, we just want to keep getting better and keep playing and and put ourselves in the driver's seat to control our own destiny. Oh, in the uh, offense, first three possessions, you guys score, uh, get a lot of big plays. Uh, talk about what you guys were able to do at that point and, and uh, how effective you felt you guys were being offensively. All right, um, you know. We just want to execute um, overall. You know, we go out there, you know, get the plays. Um, you know, really just try to you know, make no mistakes, and you know, and really just go out there and put points on the board. You know, so our defense can get back on the field. Um, we were very effective. You know, we slowed down a little bit uh, before we went into half, but second half, you know, we came out and we just put it on them. So uh, I just like to thank my linemen. You know, perfect. You know, a beautiful play calling. We just have to execute at the end of the day. It's really important. Then yeah, I guess. To close the uh, first half, you guys struggled a little on offense, but then you got it back in the second half. Anything you guys talked about at halftime, or well, you know, you just gotta, you know, have short, you know, memory. Come out, come back out, do the same thing you always do. You know, through practice, practice hard. You know, come back out second half, put it on them, just play ball, do what you have to do, execute. Like I said, Bill, same thing with you. They, you guys stopped them, and then they had that position, possession at the end of the quarter, second quarter, and then start the third quarter, and then, again, then all of a sudden you turned it again. The one thing I noticed is they were having a lot of trouble with their snaps. You're over the center. Uh, anything you saw there? Um, I mean, it's definitely tough when you have three different centers. Um, so I think that was a huge, uh, huge issue uh, just with the snaps, whether it be uh, they're not used to playing. I don't know what it is. But no, he had a lot to do with it. Just I, watch, watch the film. You know, but, so. I don't know. Uh, it's just it's tough when there's three centers in. It's because they're huge for the uh, for the offensive line. So uh, with three centers, especially beyond your third center towards the end of the game, it uh, definitely creates a lot of issues. Oh, you had a huge impact on the 
impact on the game, obviously. And I, I noticed that in the second half, you guys started doing a little more of the triple option, read option type of stuff. Mm -hmm. uh, can you describe kind of what extra element that adds to your game and the team's game as a whole when you have uh, that kind of offense that can use so many different avenues to score? Well, you know, we have a lot of great running backs that can do a lot of great things. So, you know, it was a whole team effort today, you know. Everybody did their job, running backs, quarterbacks, wide receivers, line. Uh, obviously, getting on the edges, you know, you know, significant. But I'm just, I'm just happy that our running backs were in our, in our line were able, you know, get out there and do our thing. And I feel like really showed up today. Mike, to ask a question to have a probably an obvious answer. Right after they made it 17-10, Bronson takes it back. Um, all of a sudden, it's 24-10. Uh, how, how big of a swing did you feel that was for you guys? Did, if nothing else, with momentum. No, it, it was huge. You know, the ability to answer right away. Um, he'd been close a couple times, you know, 30 something yarders the first couple games, and, and he has the speed and the, upper, and the ability to, to break it. The only thing I was upset with him about, he's, he spiked the ball. So, good thing is he's a freshman, he doesn't know. The bad thing is he's a freshman, he doesn't know. So, we'll coach him up that the next time that happens, then just hand the ball to the referee and come over to the sideline and celebrate. But, um, it was a. It was one of those turning points that uh, you know that flipped the field, the score, you know, maybe the momentum of the game as well. Oh, and I have one question. You know, fourth quarter, you guys asserted yourself on that uh, the scoring drive that made it 21 points. Have to give a lot of that to the go go wearing that defense down. Just how did you feel? And that, that was a big part of your running too. How did you feel? You prepped for that all all the off season coming in, getting ready to, for that lower. You know, we just we just work hard, you know, be coached hard. And, you know, when it comes to game time, you practice so hard all week. You get to the game and, you know, you're just doing what you did in practice. And you just, all you got to do is go out there and play. And not even think, just play football. So, big ups to our coaches, for sure. Do a great job. Anything else?